On to a shocking incident in Bengaluru now. More skeletons seem to tumble out of Bengaluru's preschool closet. In six days, seven FIRs have been lodged against the educational institution. It is alleged that more than 20 to 30 children uh, would have fallen prey to school supervisor Manjunath's abuse, while the alleged uh, serial child molester is cooling his heels behind bars. The school principal, who is the daughter of a Congress MLC, Lakshmi Narayan, is out on bail. Shrija gets us more details. More and more skeletons seem to tumble out of a preschool in Belandur after a three and a half year old girl was molested by a supervisor of this very school. What we understand is that a spate of FIRs have been filed against this very school and also on the principal Veena as well as Manjunath who happens to be a serial abuser, sexual abuser. What we know is that in the last six days at least seven FIRs were filed by parents and these these parents are taking help of Major Aditi Mohan, who is an ex-army officer and she is helping these parents go through this the legal course of this very sexual molestation case. What we understand is that it is alleged that at least more uh, students, at least 20 to 30 uh, little children have fallen prey especially to this serial abuser Manjunath. What we also know is that the school, the principal as well as uh, Manjunath, the supervisor have been booked under various sections of IPC as well as POXO Act. But meanwhile, while the police is investigating this case to find out if more and more cases have been uh, meted out to the children, what we know is that uh, the principal, Veena, happens to be the daughter of uh, Congress MLC Lakshmi Narayan, while the molester, serial molester Manjunath is cooling his heels behind the jail, the central jail, that is the Parapana Agrahara jail. This principal who has been booked under POXO has been released on bail. In Bengaluru, Shrija for Magic Breaks now. The principal completely denied that this is not possible and uh, the accused Manju Bhaiya in this situation cannot do anything like that. There are certain standards and guidelines that are being followed. We do not allow anybody and so the parents felt that they were not being supported. They decided to go to the police station to file an FIR against the individual. The individual was behind the bars. We lodged a complaint which was like four page with the documentary evidence uh, uh, with the supporting uh, signatures of all the parents but uh, it was not converted into an FIR and that was the situation. We heard a lot of gyan from all the uh, police authorities starting from the inspector to the DCP to the additional commissioner. The parents ended up actually feeling a little threatened. The questions that were being put and told was you're being speculative. When we took admissions we were uh, we were told that uh, none of the uh, none of the male staff will ever get inside. In fact, the fathers are also not allowed inside the school. So it was uh, negligence uh, on part of the principal who was uh, aware of everything going on inside the school. There, there was a very uh, weak uh, FIR filed and uh, the case which principal uh, was put under was section 188 which was so weak that she just went, she bailed out on thousand, mere thousand rupees. You can watch live TV on our website mbnow.in. Find us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash magicbricksnow. And don't forget to click the like button. You can also follow us on Twitter at Magic Bricks Now. To stay updated with all our programming, hit the subscribe button on our YouTube channel by logging on to youtube.com forward slash magicbricksnow.